One of the more prominent releases this week is Traveler's Tale's block-happy magical spin on the first four years of the Harry Potter saga. LEGO Harry Potter Years 1 through 4 comes to PlayStation 3, Wii, Xbox 360, DS, PSP, and PC, and guides players through Harry's first years at Hogwarts. Also arriving this week is Singularity, a sci-fi first-person shooter from Raven Software. The shooter combines gun-toting action with time-bending supernatural powers and will hit the PS3, Xbox 360, and PC. Those with a thirst for headshots can get their fix with City Interactive's Sniper Ghost Warrior for the Xbox 360 and PC. Taking place in Isla Truena, a fictional South American city, players will have 16 missions to complete and can enlist in multiplayer for a change of pace. Also releasing this week is 505 Games' Naughty Bear. As the name implies, the title puts players in the body of a teddy bear bent on exacting revenge upon those who have wronged him. Players are tasked with racking up naughty points and can use a variety of weapons, including a pistol and a frozen leg of lamb. The game comes to PS3 and Xbox 360 with both single player and multiplayer components. Shifting over to the PC market, Electronic Arts releases All Points Bulletin, or APB. The large-scale online game revolves around an ongoing turf war between street gangs and law enforcement officials. Players can take to the streets with up to 99 others in individualized instance virtual cities. On the Wii front, Sin and Punishment Star Successor hits Nintendo's console this week. A sequel to the Japan-exclusive original, Star Successor is an on-rails shooter with boss fights and more. Sony put their sights on the Virtual Court this week, releasing the latest Hot Shots title. Hot Shots Get a Grip comes to the PSP and will be available both at retail and in the PlayStation Store. For further details on the week's game, visit GameSpot's new releases page. Release dates are based on retailer listings and are subject to change. <laughs>